Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our Father's Frontier series. So let's uh, jump straight into it and it seems our villagers are a little unhappy. Entertainment is pretty low. Let's have a look. What else do we have access to? Oh, the pub and theater. Okay, for the pub, can we... <laughs> okay, we got quite a bit of wheat, so actually we could set it up. Now, another thing what I have realized, I know this episode is, is already quite a bit into it, but at the time when I'm recording it, only the first episode has gone out so far. And what I have realized when I was uh, editing it and looking through as well, is that our location might not be the best for defending our town. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's nothing wrong, um, too bad uh, happening here, and we can always beef up our defenses with more towers, but that more towers is going to be more cold and expensive for our town. What I did, however, realize is we have a bit of a lake in here, I think it was. And on this side as well, there's another massive lake somewhere in the distance over there. So if we were a bit more smart, it would actually be much easier and better to have most of the town somewhere here. And with a defensive wall going from one lake or river, not really sure what it was over here. I think it was a lake, yeah going through all the way to the other lake. So that way all of our defensive towers would have to be um, lined up right here. And when it comes to farming, this area is all fertile. We could have could have had our farms right there. And I mean, we still have pretty easy access to iron as well, which we could mine from these zones. Yep, tons of iron all the way around. So we would not be running out of it anytime soon. The only thing that will be further away is, of course, gold. But then again, I think, uh, you know, even if it really wanted to go all the way there, it is further It is further away, but we could access it. I mean, I would personally skip it, most likely. But looking at this area as well, there's tons of resources there, more fertile areas. And, hmm. Yeah, I guess hunting would have to happen a little further away but with the wagons we could bring them in oh look at that we've got iron here as well and even quite a bit of clay sand who knows maybe there is a bit more there but actually what we might do whilst we have the staff i believe yeah quite a few laborers why don't we take a peek and see okay we can't go any further so that means the lake must be starting somewhere there okay we'll scout out this whole area can't go any further this way either okay uh, some of you will not make it because there's probably wolves okay I think yeah it looks like the lake goes from about here so it is pretty wide for a town yeah let's check it out let's have a look what's over there uh, whilst we are waiting for the results to come in I think another thing we can do seems where some of the villagers are complaining that we are not cleaning their houses fast enough okay so if we go to the resources we could do another compost yard somewhere i mean this could even go outside the town i think or here hmm no it's all pretty uneven it seems a bit of space here but it's quite far I mean, I guess we could even... Let's see, how far do you have to be? I suppose we could build you here. Yep, so why don't we do it? Let's set you right over there. We'll speed up the time as well. And... <laughs> I think also... No, actually, I don't think. I know. Um, I'm pretty sure I missed... Totally missed the this deposit of coal when we were building all of these charcoal kilns. Yes, so what we shall do, let's mine out this coal in here, if we still have space, of course. Oh no, space seems to be an issue. So unfortunately, one of those smoke uh, houses needs to move a little bit, but that's too close to the houses. Any space somewhere around here? Uh, yeah. I guess we can place you here, right? Well, we are going to have one more house. Let's see. Are you going to affect... Okay, you should not... 
be in our way, so that's good. We can also apply in the compost. Uh, <laughs> 91, let's uh, sit you down right over there. Okay, with us being tier 3 right now, 4 is a bit of a far stretch. Yeah, we need quite a few bricks, a bit more gold as well, and also blanks. So we are definitely going to have to work our way up there. I would like you, however, to speed up all of this. Yeah. And let's do the same as well. Give you a priority. Hopefully we get this done rather quickly. Maybe we'll add another weaver and a builder as well. Okay, there we go. What are we building here? I think we are going to pause the expansion on this side. For now at least. I mean, if we really are moving... Yeah, let's pause it. But then again... Hmm... This will be a very long wall. Yeah, a lot more to defend. But if we really wanted to, we could do so. So we won't have to build, let's say, walls on this side at all. Because it's a natural barrier, uh, barrier then. Same in here. Much easier to place a wall, bring it a little further out. Uh, however, this side is all... Hmm, yeah. This mountain isn't really in a great spot. Another thing we could have done, actually. <clears throat> um, unfortunately, we have this graveyard here. But we could have flattened this mountain a little bit. Bring the production all up here. Maybe some uh, towers around it. So we get the defensive bonuses. Yeah, this could be cool, actually. And with the town then over there. I mean, it won't be too far away, to be honest. It's a, it's a lot of time would be wasted on walking. 1,565, okay, cool. Let's uh, quickly check how much we have here. Oh, not a lot, okay. Well, that's fine. Anyways, they've moved the smokehouse. They're about to build it over there. I think we can now start mining a bit of coal. Okay, this one goes there. Fantastic. And you are full. Okay, what do you have? Loads of milk. I guess it's a good time to, let me just run it at a slower speed. We did have a bakery, didn't we? Oh no, the cheese maker. That's what I'm after. Okay, so you are gonna need bricks, which we almost have. Wait, that's a healer's house. Okay. So, <laughs> I guess we can place you here somewhere here for now. Yeah, that's not a not a bad spot at all. Okay, let's do there. And bricks we have, blanks we have. Great, let's see what we can trade. Okay, pretty low prices, so we're not selling anything. It would be cheap to buy some bricks as well. Wheat, we're growing, no need. Logs are good. Um, maybe some baskets and... Hmm, actually, we need to improve our economy quite a bit. I mean, shirts we could sell. They do come through sometimes. We'll wait for another um, trader. But, hmm. <laughs> I think baskets is perhaps the main thing. Luxury. Well, everything's pretty fine. Shoes, clothes. Yeah. Let's see what we can do about the entertainment then. Okay, so we've got the pub and the theater, which is pretty expensive. Oh, Bob, we are going to have to start brewing. And everything else we've built. Yeah, so maybe... Maybe a pub or something. Okay. Let's have a quick look again. Where is... <laughs> Happy entertainment. Yeah. Alright, another merchant has arrived. Let's see what the second one gives us. Okay, logs are pretty cheap. But he's not buying any. Let's... Hmm. Baskets for 16... 14, so we could make a bit of money. Alright. Uh, crossbows, well, we're not really making any. Bricks is 10. And you are selling them for, oh, 10 as well, it seems. Okay. Shoes will be actually lovely. Everything else, we're, we're pretty good. Okay, so how about... Let's see, what do we want to sell? Baskets. Yeah, we get a bit of coin from that. Buy and stock everything. 
so actually bricks will be better to sell let's see oh no that's the same 10 and 10 okay basket basket to these and yep not a lot of money but that's a little bit bit of extra hundred and something okay and everything else we don't really have just yet all right how much wheat do we have right now in the storage nothing at all let's just check the size of our field that is right over here okay so maybe we too want to expand you just a little bit guess we'll see let's um, check if they have already scouted out this area here oh okay we have quite a bit of clay actually at the back over there all right so that's pretty good it gets more narrow as we advance oh yeah it's pretty narrow here and let's see maybe that's the end of the map then oh no maybe it's surrounded by water on all sides so let's um finish off the scouting mission here and we have our third merchant now as well so what about you 13 only ah that's not good yeah you're 14 okay candles classware which we don't have a cheese as well and you're buying herbs or medicine okay hmm tools fish don't need tools we need iron we have tons of it uh <laughs> Same with you. <laughs> yep, don't really want anything, is it? Would be great to sell some glassware, so maybe we need some sand, which I don't think anyone was selling. Okay. Yeah. Oh, hold on a second. Okay, so we're not making a lot of money this year, that's for sure. Everything we have, they don't really want, or it's brand prices. I mean, we could sell some iron. Oh, you don't have any, any money, so... What are you selling again? Let's take the belts off here. Yeah? Iron stock, okay, a little bit. And with the rest... Uh, I mean, rocks... We are gonna run out when we start upgrading. Actually, let's give you as much iron as we can right now. Which isn't, of course, a lot, but okay. Uh, right, food is fine, I believe. It should be okay. So maybe we take some shoes. That's gonna transfer. We shall give it to the villagers instead. And here you go. Now that you have a bit of money, we are gonna take it back from you again. Okay. There we go. Is there anything else we can swap around? Hmm yeah really bad prices soap we have a little bit could sell that as well but everything else yeah okay we'll leave it last check for you as well nope nothing do we want to buy oh yeah actually eight and selling for ten but there's nothing else we really want to buy uh do you know what we'll we'll leave it for now where are those raiders so they are coming from... Oh, okay. Okay, we've got one tower here. So let's do it. Let's see how this one goes. A couple of towers actually here. Not just one. And we'll speed you up as well. Yeah, everything is fine. These guys are running away. They're coming... Oh, from over the hill. So we're not going to get any bonuses from that tower... Same with this one. Okay, let's see. Very good. You guys are gonna move. Oh, they're not moving down there. Well, that's no good. Let's slow you down just a little bit. Oh, right. Okay. At least we have this barracks over here. I mean, only two soldiers in there. And they broke through pretty quickly. Let's see, where are they going to go next? For this one we can rebuild. Have they gone through? No. Nope. Yeah, our defenses are pretty poor if I'm honest. It's only this section here that's strong enough right now. 
Okay, what is that? I think that's a bear. Uh, yep, so we're fine on that end. They've broken through these walls here pretty quickly as well. It seems our barracks and this tower... Oh, actually the uh, district center as well, which is doing pretty good. Not the district center, uh, the head town center. Okay, is anyone... No, that's fine. And you're gonna run into these towers as well. Okay. It's probably gonna break through, but that's fine. And they have already run off. Okay. Yep, our defenses aren't, you know, nothing to be proud of. But then, on the other hand, we survived. Yeah. Didn't really destroy much, so we should be okay. I think we do want to increase our production for the blanks as well. Oh, you are going to require that. Oh, we get another merchant. Uh, coal, okay. Pretty good prices, gold. And everything. Oh, shirts. You're only buying them. If we had bought those shirts, we could sell them for a slightly better price, it seems. Uh, anything else that you might have? Stones is cheap. That's fine. We don't really need you. I guess we can sell the logs. Let's just get a little bit more money. Okay. And stones, 400 right now. Yeah, let's leave the rest for the time being. Okay, did anyone pass away? It seems we are missing a hunter. And let's check again. Has anyone been scouting this area? Oh, there is someone here. Okay, it does seem like it's a bit of a peninsula. So yeah, we can definitely do some... Um, fisherman huts in this area. Hopefully to try and mine out this clay as well. But otherwise, seems like a pretty good area. Yeah, we could definitely do the first layer of down here and get it to a pretty reasonable size. We also have a spawn of deer, which is quite good. I mean, for the rest of the meat, we are going to have to venture out a little further. Hmm. Yeah, it would definitely reduce the amount of towers that we do need. And maybe some of the production could go up here. Or in front of the town. Who knows. But I am starting to like this idea. So maybe first... Hmm, let's see. How many builders do we have? We have 12, 30 laborers right now. Uh, so maybe we do start to figure out how we can bring things over. Okay. Seems like a lot more houses are complaining. But we do have another compost yard up, which is good. So perhaps it's just going to take a little bit of time and we'll have to be a bit more patient and over time they should clear it up very nicely. I do think we are going to need to try and capture some of those rats in this area. So maybe uh, we'll build one more there. I think we had one... Okay, there we go. So you're already covering these buildings. Okay, so that should be good because there's no other buildings that require... And if we wanted to be smarter as well, we could try and build them a little bit closer to each other. Okay. And with this zone, did we lose a tower... Uh, yes, we have. Maybe we forgot to rebuild them since the last raid. Where are you all off to? Oh, they are picking apples because... Why are they going all the way around? Wouldn't this be a little bit shorter? 
I guess it will be, but they just don't have the the roads. Yeah, let's build this road just like so for the time being. Uh, cheese maker. Okay, please get this built a little bit quicker as well. So that way we can... Uh, wait, they've done almost all the bricks. So there's quite a few still left in there. Okay, we don't have enough bricks, but I'm sure we will get some more very soon, right? Yeah, okay. Beautiful. So, to connect those things up and make everything, the progression a little bit smoother and quicker, we shall start bringing those roads in here. And maybe it would be also smart to bring some of the work camps a little bit closer as well. Um, well, you look at that. So, if we build it down here, that means there's so many less sides to defend from. Yeah, so I guess the first layer could go straight through somewhere here. And then our expansion or the production zone could be literally in this corner here. Yeah, I'm really, really starting to like this idea and I think this ground seems pretty flat as well, which is great. Um, with the roads, we still have to figure it out, but we could try and get some of those resources as we are, as we build up the town. Okay, we've got tons of logs still, right? Yes, we do. So defenses, what's the... What's a good location? Perhaps through here. Uh, I do wanna... <laughs> let's see, which side? Oh, we can't see you just yet. Okay, fine. Let's not worry about it too much. I'm sure they will relocate themselves a little bit, so... Or maybe one more. Yep, let's bring you through like so. All the way, it's gonna take a long time to construct this, but we'll be fine. And then with the road, how it's going as well. Okay, straight through. We shall cancel that. All right, I think we're doing it. Yeah. And this road comes in. Okay, beautiful. Let me just have to figure out how do we want to do the layout for the town. Um, I haven't done a lot more testing. I'm sure there is a better way to do it than this. I would like to very much cram some more buildings in here. So perhaps, let's say we get rid of this road, this one here and create a slightly bigger block of houses. Okay, because when we start building a bigger town as well, things get a little laggy. Obviously more people, more pathfinding, and I'm not entirely sure what exactly consumes the most resources in this game, but in quite a few early game, early access games as well, pathfinding can eat up quite a few resources, I believe. But again, I might be completely wrong about this as well, so don't take my word for it. Anyways, so we got the bricks right now. We can start producing some more blanks. Additional workers, it speeds it up a little bit, and we can use heavy tools as well, which is also something we'd like to start producing. How's everything going? Okay, so... We've taken out the trash, it seems. Yeah. Water. And the rats are a problem. You covered these ones now. So how about... I think the, uh, some of those houses are within the range already. So let's adjust you just a little bit. Firewood, you are always an issue, aren't you? Where are we chopping you up? Uh, it's a little difficult to find them. Okay, I'm pretty sure it was... Is it this one? No, it is not that one. 
What else do we have? Okay, the foundry is here. Your forager. It's not those ones here, is it? No. Not these ones. That's the weaver. Okay, that's a bit of a nightmare. Let's um, take a look from a different angle. We should see some people chopping up some logs. Alright, give me a second. I'm just gonna try and try and find this real quick. No, these are hunters over here. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere right in front of me, but for some reason I am unable to spot it. Alright guys, where are you? I mean, I can hear something, but I can't see them. Okay, resources, what do you look like? Firewood splitter. Yeah, it's definitely not close to... I wish it sort of highlighted the building as well. And I've got it selected anyways. Okay, let's leave you for a second. Um, <laughs> new year, some more villagers. We'll probably do some candles, more candles as well. Uh, oh, actually, firewood. Well, yeah, it's definitely going up. I don't know how I can't find them. Anyways, 99, 94, 92. Taxes in as well, so that's good. I think for now, let's just do another one. Just like so, over here. Give you a priority. Because everyone's constructing the wall right now. Yeah. Okay, seems like we have some more bugs. You're not... Okay, there we go. Thought I placed you... Ah, oh, there we go, firewood splitter. It was right in front of us this whole time. So what's your limits currently? 300, so that's fine. Okay, we'll get the second one up as well, so that way we can increase the produce. Walls are going up pretty, pretty nicely and quickly over here, so that is great. Uh, perhaps another stockpile. We'll set it to just logs can help us speed up the production and we bring the work camps over as well. Alright, another merchant has arrived. What do you have? Hmm. Okay, maybe some coats. Just like so. Shoes we don't have. I should probably increase the production of that as well. Logs are selling pretty good, so take them all. And I think with the transfer, let's drop you a little bit, because we don't want to run out of all the logs. Uh, right, right, right. Everything else, I don't think we want to sell. But do we want to buy anything? No, food, we have tons. Medicine is okay. Wheat, we still have some leftovers. And... Okay. What about you? What are you buying? Oh, shirts are going for 16, so that's not too bad. Okay, there we go. We have found what we want to sell here. Let's set you to about 87. Oh, you can take a lot, actually. Never mind. Okay, we'll turn off the automatic stocking. Oh, no, never mind. Let's, let's keep it on, since we have a lot of iron and we can always mine for some more. Armor will be good. Oh, we have enough cold, actually. Oh, no, you're buying it. Uh, cheese, I think we just started producing new bricks we could buy, but it's not necessary. Alright, let's see. Is the cheese maker up? Yes, you are. Do we have milk? Okay, it's coming in. Let's see. People, we seem to be okay. So let's do perhaps four people in here. Unable to work. Uh, not sure why, but I'm sure... Hopefully it's going to change. Maybe it's because we ran out of milk. I don't know. We'll give them a bit of time to figure it out. And we'll speed up the time as well. Let's try and sell some of that iron real quick. You don't have a lot of money. We could get... Oh yeah, let's sell... Let's see, a bit more. 
All right, there we go. 1,600. Oh, let's slow it down. 21. Was anyone selling shirts? Uh, <laughs> if only we had bought them before. So, clay goes for 5. You're not selling clay, but I think you were. Oh no, that's 5 as well. Not useful. Baskets, no. Iron, 15. 13. Oh. Okay. Could get a little bit more money from you. Belts we are definitely gonna take. Buy in stock. Uh, soap is pretty cheap as well, and I think we can buy it quite often, can we not? So we'll take you all. Tallow is fine. Logs, no. Stones, yeah, eventually we shall. And the rest we are not really interested in, so... Since you have quite a bit of money now. We shall want to have it all back. Any of you selling baskets? No, you weren't. Just some bricks and cheese. Okay. Bricks and cheese. Uh, just the bricks over here. And trade a three. No. Okay. I think that should be fine, right? We'll get a bit more money from you. And we are still making some more iron as well. Still another thousand. What is it? 500 left. Uh, in the cold. Okay. Buy these ones as well. 800. We got 7,000. Almost 8,000 now. So that's definitely going to help us a, a lot. Do a final check. Is there anything else we want to buy? Nothing from you. Cheese we're making. Trader 1. Do you have any good prices for us? I guess medicine could be lovely. Uh, he's left already. Probably should have bossed it, but oh well. That's alright. Uh, wait a second. You've got no more money left. Bought it for a second. Tons of money here now. And I think... You know what? Let's just sell it all. Yep. And turn this off. We'll save the iron for... For ourselves for the time being. Okay, so that's uh, that's going good. How is the wall coming along? 56 raiders again. Oh dear. Okay, one second. Just a little bit left and then we can start moving over. I mean, we do want to start moving over now actually. Don't want to delay it any longer. So you're coming from this side. Uh, right. That's a good side to pick because our defenses are pretty pretty bad on this side. Okay, yeah, here they come. So all of this is going to get destroyed. All this here as well. Not good defense, well, no defenses on here. Yeah, our income isn't great either. We just need to start upgrading buildings and stuff a little bit quicker, I think. And this expansion was going to provide that, but now that we are changing changing things around a little bit... Uh, okay, so you're a little bit annoying. We shall try and get rid of you. <clears throat> if we survive, of course. Ooh, okay, here goes the houses. And there's a lot of warriors over here, so we might not even be able to take you down but we do have a couple more towers that are definitely helping us uh, let's get a few more hunters as well okay there we go Ooh. yeah that is definitely not ideal quite a few things destroyed here get the market up again okay uh, let's do this let's highlight everything Rebuild. Alright, there we go. Where are you off to? Uh, don't have a lot of health, so... Alright. Well, there we go. Since they are running away now, we can... Turn off the... Alarm. I think everything's getting rebuilt as well. Okay. 
Right, so there we go. Um, how shall we go about relocating everything? Uh, houses first or production? Oh, wait, we lost uh, two soldiers as well. Oh, that's going to cost us a little bit. And a fisherman. Okay. Yeah, I think this. I sent them too far into the where the enemies were. Uh, you guys are unfilled because I have a feeling we have lots of coal. Right. 300. What we can do instead, we want people to work in those, not in the charcoal kilns. So once it goes back online, we shall fix you up. You have a little bit better access now. Uh, okay. Village was raided. We lost four people, killed 18, and they destroyed 18 buildings. Interesting. Okay, let's bring this road through this area a little bit further. Yeah, the wall's pretty much done now. And in here as well, let's uh, start thinking about how far into this we want to go. I guess um, this one could be the double layered wall. How much logs do we... We have quite a few few logs to the left. Yeah, quite a, quite a few. So we can double up on here, I suppose. Okay, just a little bit further. How far can you go? Right about there. And same on this side. Right. So I am thinking to... Oh, okay. We'll accept you. Might not have the houses. So let's give you a couple more. I know we are going to move them. Yes, but... Let's take a few more build um, people in so we can construct things a little bit faster. Yeah, 18. Let's do 20. There we go. Right. So moving houses first makes no sense because then they have even longer distance to travel to work. Uh, I think it makes a bit more sense to move our production over. The only thing we cannot move over is the town center, but the only way around it is to destroy it because we can rebuild the town center. Okay, right, let's do this. Uh, additional housing, yes, we are aware. Uh, okay, so maybe we give you a slightly higher priority to get those built as well. Is everything repaired over here? Almost. We should probably do the towers as quick as we can. <clears throat> okay, did we lose any more? Oh, yes, there is one more. We shall rebuild you and give you a priority. There we go. This one's still fine in here. And the same with the section right here okay production first um, oh someone else has died there's a hunter laborer numbers are pretty low I think the charcoal kilns went online no they did not so we could rem remove one anyways those farms yeah that's gonna be a slightly longer progress to get uh, farms over but we'll, we'll try Okay. Instead of building another work camp, since the logs uh, kind of okay right now, I suppose. Uh, let's take you over first. Okay, here we go. A little further. And the question is, do we want to leave? I think a three wide here is good. We do a tower right by the entrance. And then you can go here for the time being. Right, so there we go. I guess the first road could be if we wanted decorations. Or maybe we leave a four wide. In case we want to do another wall here. Yeah, let's do four wide since we do have a bit more space, right? Yeah, we could do a pretty big town. What's the blueprint or footprint? Uh, <laughs> Well, we gotta start from somewhere, right? So, yeah, let's do four. That seems like the safest option. 
and then you're gonna go through just like so on this side as well okay we'll get the work camp here and it's not a too long of a distance right now we could also relocate one of the hunters I think yep we got one over here and that's pretty far these ones can stay there a little bit closer still far away of course but a little bit better and you can go just like so okay so there we go uh, four wide and this one is actually gonna be four wide as well I do want to put some I think like log piles and things in here resources and then we start with the town development actually it doesn't leave us a lot of space for the town so maybe what we should really do is figure out what's the furthest we can go here okay the road runs about this far and you are of course gonna go both ways okay oh yeah you can only go this far okay to be on the safe side let's see if the houses actually never mind let's leave the houses for now we'll bring over the production we might have to do it in a couple of steps of course um, but yeah there we go here's our double wall going up pretty nicely gold income is not too bad right now and we can also do let's say a gate right over here one here and one here okay couple more of these ones and your zone oh that one was quick can you please prioritize the work camp as well okay there we go so we are we are slowly starting to move over which is fantastic I think the next one we do want to build let's um, jump over here again actually uh, storage stockyard we can put one right over here okay let's place you like so and what we shall store here is probably gonna be I think we're gonna have to remove pretty much everything and just keep the logs rocks things like that yeah let's do that now with the other stuff we have to be kind of careful about our production lines uh, you are complaining that we don't have let's have a look okay tons of arrows there's some bows weapons right so I'm not really sure why you are complaining firewood is low we do have another building here slot disabled well let's enable it Okay, logs are finally starting to go a little bit lower as well. So we do want to have this work camp operational and running ASAP. I think for that we are also going to construct a another one. Yeah. Okay, new year. And the next thing we'll do... Should we do it now? Yeah, let's create or leave a bit of a space for the for the towers to go Camp gate here tower and same just like so which shall allow us to place a few more gates let's just do one more I mean getting through four is gonna take quite a bit of time for them anyways and then maybe entrances right like so okay good let's prioritize you as well you're gonna be another priority Laborer numbers are low, but that we do understand. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this isn't going to be a lot of space for a town. I don't think so. Quite lovely fertile lands, of course. But we don't really need to protect the farm, so we're going to take over this whole area. Merchant has arrived, so we can uh, make a bit more coin. Ooh, all these things that we don't have sell for pretty good money. Tools 44. 
Ooh, that is crazy expensive. I guess we can get a few crude weapons from you. Because that's the lowest price I've seen. Maybe 10. We just stock you. Not gonna hand you out just yet. And everything else is pretty expensive. So we are gonna wait. have to wait for the other traders first. To see... Why are you still complaining? Oh. I do know why. That is because we sent you out. Return to barracks. So now you can start looking for weapons and arrows and everything. Okay. Beautiful. Let's have a look. We can... Push you through all the way there. And with this forest here as well. Yep. I'll hold down the shift so it keeps the road nice and straight. There we go. I still haven't built either of those ones. Okay, so all the resources. Yep, we'll go here. No food. That's good. And you're hunting. This would be a lovely spot to gather... Uh, few resources uh, right so let's um, get this started so market oh okay we can do it this way instead we can do one town section somewhere here and once we upgrade you're gonna touch the water so let's see it goes about this far and another one here okay and the four, one, two, three. Okay. We can leave this area intact and use it for gathering some herbs and some food items. Okay, we got a couple more merchants, so let's be a bit, much, bit smarter this time. We'll pause the game for a second and let's see what you are purchasing and selling. So we can't really sell anything to you. Uh, 36 for the tools. You are... Oh, uh, you're only selling them as well. You're not purchasing them. That's a bit unfortunate. Uh, anything else do we need? Weapons will be actually kind of handy. But the rest of it is expensive. Yeah. Another not so good year. 26 for the class. I think... Oh yeah, 26 as well. So we can't really cheat the system over there. And all this is fine. Right, so this year we're not very good with with all those purchases. Did we want anything from you? No, we did not. And same, that's the lowest. It's the only resource we have. I, I think we'll just take a few. A thousand worth and transfer. Okay. Now we can resume the time as well. And let's see, what shall we start moving next, actually? Let's do the compost real quick as well. Uh, 95, so onto that field. Water is a little bit low. Right, well, we're not going to stay here for long, but just for the time being, we shall give you a well, like so. Right, there we go. So numbers seem to be good right now. A lot of those production lines are paused as well. 300, okay. That's fine. We're just a little low on the logs. Have we built... Okay, we do have one. Couple more people here. Maybe we start deforesting that area first. And with you, we have a lot more space on both of those sides. So we can even bring the third camp over. You speed up everything. Uh, right. So if this is... Hmm. Okay, yeah, this is fine. So we want to... Which way do we want to do the towns? I guess it will be decorations here. First house, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So maybe... Maybe something like... Like this. One house, decoration, one, two, three, okay, I think it's going to be boxes like so, I think so, and the middle bit, 
how... Oh, that was another three, wasn't it? One, two, three, one. One, two, three, and one. Okay, how far do we have to go? Uh, right, there we go. And another housing district. One... Is there water here? No, that's not water. Okay. One, two, three. Decoration. One, two, three. And we shall... Yep. That seems like... Is it though? Oh, no, it's not. Of course it's not. It's the wrong way around. And we shall remove you as well. Okay. Uh, let's take a look again. <laughs> Road. Inside the menu, we are going to have house. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then one, two. And a road here. Yep, that looks more like it. So that's the first block. And then we shall keep going through there. Which means, yeah, everything is going to be moved around. A little bit more, of course. And let's set you to trees only as well. Yep, since we do have enough rocks right now, but we just need a lot more more of those logs. Are you filling up? No, you're not. Let's plan out the next section, which will be just about here. And then we see where to place the market as well. I mean and bring you through all the way and now if we have a quick quick check market oh yeah like this seems like a decent area here we don't want to go any further but about here so as soon as we finish measuring this out one two three one one two three another road just like so and then you can connect up there. Okay. I think that's how we need it. And then we can do one. Let's see. One, two, three. One, one, two, three. Perfect. Bring it all the way down. Connect you up. Right. Can't quite do three districts in here. Maybe we could have done it lengthwise. Maybe. So one here. No, not really. That's okay then. A slightly different shape, but... Uh, did I mess something up? I might have done something wrong, but that's okay. Let's see. So these houses there... It's gonna be this way. Oh uh, no, everything should be fine. I think the middle bit isn't long enough. Or is it? Let's grab a couple of houses and measure this out. Do we have an, enough space for three houses? Uh, hello? Let's grab a house. One. Oh, I see. Yeah. One, two, three. That's what we did wrong. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So the road should actually be somewhere here. Not somewhere. Exactly there. Yeah. And you connect up with those. Which also means that you're going to push a little further down, aren't you? Just by one. Which makes the... Oh, okay. So this road needs to go. Right. Not a problem. We'll just bring you over one more time. 
Uh, I guess we're gonna have to wait until they are properly built, but that's that's fine. Okay. Get rid of uh, these sections as well. Perfect. And then we're not going to bring the towers over just yet. Because we don't really have anything in here. But what we can already see now that we do have the layout in place. We can already see that our sort of storages and some of the buildings can go in this line. Yep, that should be fine, I think. But all the production will have to go a little further out. Yeah, so this means the wall is not really where we want it to be, I think. But I think we're okay right now because with all the production, we can... I'm pretty sure we can just line them up just like so. And if we want to keep keep the um, the forest harvesting close to our town, uh, not the desirability. Let's see fertility. Yep. So farms would actually have to. Well, I guess we're gonna have to figure this out. Yeah. I mean, I suppose we could do them here. This fertility is pretty fine as well. Yeah, maybe start from somewhere around here and then work our way down for one, another one in this corner, and with the the waste that we are collecting from the town as well, we can increase the fertility pretty quickly. Okay. Yeah, all of these are fine. Roads are going in very nice and quickly. Hmm... Can bring one side of the town in here already. Leave this side a little bit. Maybe no houses in here, and we just do a bit of harvesting of resources. More towers will be needed for sure. Uh, let's see. We'll let the log numbers go up a little bit. And we are quickly going to check if our measurements were correct. So we had the first house, second one, third one, yep. One, two, and three. Okay, good. One, two, and three. And then we have a two wide cap in here as well. Okay, that's good. Taxes were collected as well. These roads can go. Okay. And now we just connect you up over there. Oh. Uh, did I mess something up? Let's try again. Okay. Here we go. And the last one. Okay. There we go. Everything's connected up and... Well, I guess we can fix you up make this area a little bit wider this only needs to be four wide right currently it's five and uh, the wagon is picking up some resources as well or maybe dropping off who knows we've got a merchant that has arrived what are you 39 oh that's pretty lovely and belts we shall take for sure Okay, what else is pretty cheap? Medicine, I guess we could, but it's not really necessary. We we don't need medicine, we're okay as well. Other herbs, I mean, sorry. Tons of meat in the storage. So maybe we need to cook it up a little quicker. Actually, yeah, let's check this real quick. Uh, you only take one person. So I think that's what we... Yeah, we, we're going to need a bit more. Right. This field... Ah, uh, no. Wrong button. Here we go. Apply compost. Let's do it here. These buildings are no longer needed. And this work camp... Do you know what? Mm, perhaps we are taking you... To the other side now as well. 
No, let's leave you. Another merchant. Alright, so what about you? Baskets. <laughs> oh, blanks we can do. Take a hundred of those. Logs, no. And the rest... Uh, <laughs> Not really, I mean... Maybe pottery is something we could purchase. How many do you have? Uh, let's have a look. How much is it going to cost us? Oh, 4,000. Yikes, maybe we leave it for for a little while. And with the rest, uh, I think we are okay. I mean, unless we are going to sell some more blanks. Okay, let's set it up. So it's automatic. There we go. Let's check the villages as well. Everything seems to be okay. Um, right, right, right. How about we move a little bit of the village over? And then some of the production as well. So the weaver, for example, you require flax only. And this doesn't rely on anything else. Let's just double check that it doesn't affect... No, it does not. So, yeah, you can go here. Okay. Uh, there we go. Speed up the time. Weaver can go over first. You are paused. So, let's move you over now as well. Since they don't really like you a lot. So, oh yeah, we are going to have to change these roads as well. Of course. Uh, this means you are in the way. Just a little bit, but let's move you over. And same with you. Okay, there we go. And once this is done, we can move the rest as well. We'll pause you. I think when it comes to access, uh, that's quite a long road. Why don't we upgrade you a little bit so we can deliver, or well, they can walk a little bit faster and, well, I guess deliver everything, yeah, a little bit quicker as well. I can't quite grab this road. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's going to help us probably a lot during the transition time. Does it say as well how much it's going to speed us up? No, it just says it, it's increased the movement speed. But um, we've got the stones right now. Let's upgrade it. So that way everything else can become more efficient a lot quicker. Uh, okay, yeah, that's going to be quite a few things for, for us to do. It's going to take a bit of time. Probably going to make certain areas a bit more difficult and annoying but we will get there eventually I think with the roads we'll do it in sections as well so when it comes to upgrading well, we don't have to spend all the stones in one go right so reset your hunting area over there that's the weaver okay you'll be fine as well I guess for uh, storage, let's have a look. You take quite a few resources. We had a few over there already. Oh, some of those roads we probably don't need, but for now, if we place two in here, tons of blanks, bit of rocks, yeah. And I'll pause the one of them, but the other one, if we set it to flax, then at least those resources are gonna be a little bit closer. Okay, so that's good. And now it's really going to be just about moving stuff over. We'll leave this district here for the time being, because that's bringing us in some money. Whereas you can go first. And what would have been smart, actually? We figured the layout, um, our blueprint out a little bit better. We could even do a line of decorations and wells in the middle middle so how about we just kind of plan it where we roughly want it so let's say hmm this market oh yeah something like oh, wrong click 
if this goes here... No, one more over. Okay, this is going to be a little bit easier. We'll pause the construction. So you're going to cover quite a bit of this area. We have a few houses. Once the area of, eff of effect is going to increase, we'll get a few more houses within the range. Okay. So perhaps, yeah, somewhere around these areas where we do the sort of central access road. And then we can do wells in the middle. I don't quite remember how much of a bigger range do we get once it's upgraded. So let's have a look here. If we place you right on top, I think it's about one or two, let's say two tiles. Um, yeah, let's do that. We'll zoom over here again. Oh, okay. It's going to be difficult. So we'll use this tree as the marker. So this is the first one in. You're on this tile. Say this one as well. And I think this is perfect. Yeah. Uh, I think we got pretty lucky with, with this one. So with the wells, you're going to be the first one. Next one. Too close. Okay. This seems fine. And maybe somewhere here then. Yeah, we'll put the well network in first. Let it accumulate a bit of water. And then we can do some more around the village itself as well. Okay, and then we just um, either relocate the market or bring it over. Yeah, we'll see. It's going to be quite tedious moving them all over. Well, at least the road is now complete. But uh, it's something we are going to have to do. Because it's going to be so much, yeah, definitely so much easier to defend this area at a, at a later, later stage. We could even do another wall from somewhere around here, actually. Just to protect the uh, housing. I mean, most of the time they don't really care about the housing so much. They just want to, the raiders, I mean, they just want to come, in, come in into our village and steal the resources. But we've seen it in our previous ones. If uh, there's going to be houses on their way to to our storehouses, then they're pretty happy to destroy quite a few things in, in their way as well. Okay, some of the wells are already in, which is lovely. So they are building up some water already. Uh, there we go. Um, okay, so that's what we are going to do in the next episode as well. It is going to take a bit of time, but we'll um, get quite a, quite a few things transferred over. Uh, transferring things over is the easy part. The more sort of long-term difficult part is we are going to have to figure out the farms in here as well, because we don't want to starve our village when everything gets moved over. And right now this distance is very, very far away. We'll probably keep those farms for a little while and put some more temporary housing there. Oh, we have a bit more compost over here, it seems. Let's plant you as well. Uh, you're already done, maybe over there. But yeah, we don't want to have those farms this far from our village. Probably somewhere here is more suitable. But okay, let's cut the episode over here. So we shall continue in the next one. For now, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode.